Pulse nightclub told a large crowd in New York City today, we need to turn our grief into solidarity and overcome the evil that has happened through love. As Amanda Castro shows, the club owner was the guest of honor for the kickoff of this weekend's Pride Rally in New York. From the growing memorial in front of Pulse nightclub to the Big Apple, the colors of the rainbow are crossing the country. New York City kicking off its Pride Weekend, a celebration of love and equality, but with a somber and serious tone. The Orlando nightclub massacre still on everyone's minds. Pulse owner Barbara Poma was the guest of honor for last night's LGBT Pride rally. The names of the 49 lives lost were read aloud. Then a moment of silence while their faces flashed across the screens. Poma telling the large crowd Pulse and all that it represents is still alive. I want you to know that Orlando and the world's gay community are strong and united. We will not allow evil to prevail. The club's entertainment manager echoing the same message. Allow the love to embrace you. So what I want you all to do right now for us in honor of DePaul's Orlando, turn to the person next to you, give them a hug and say, my brother, my sister, I love you. Hours before the rally, President Obama issued an executive order designating the Stonewall Inn and Christopher Park across the street in Greenwich Village as a national monument where the modern gay rights movement began in 1969. Before leaving for New York, Poma told News 6 the Empire State knows what Orlando is going through after suffering their own tragedy on 9-11. In Orlando, Amanda Castro, News 6.